So Gary, welcome to Exeter City. How pleased are you to have signed for the club? Yeah, delighted, delighted to be honest with you. Um, I can't, I can't wait now to, to get started um, and to get the season underway. Um, but very, very honoured um, and privileged to come in, to come and play um, for for a club like this. Um, obviously, the last few years, the club have, have, have made sort of big strides and have, have sort of nearly, nearly got promoted out of the league. Um, so yeah, delighted to, to come and be part of a of a good team. Of course, got lots of experience. That should be something that serves you well coming into the new season. Do you think? Yeah, I hope so. I hope so. Um, played a few games, so I'm hoping that that any any experience I can. I can have and can pass on to any of the lads will will help us and in, in, in benefit us over the season. And you know a few of the lads as well, Alex Fisher. Uh, he's looking forward to lining up alongside him, Exeter. Yeah, yeah. There's a few lads obviously from last year that, that played against um, and, and Fish as well that played with Danny Yeovil. Um, so good. I met the lads only a couple of days, but but to be honest, the, the group are a really strong group. Um, and that's that's for me. That's one thing that, that that will carry you over the over the line during the season. Um, you got a good good team spirit and a good good morale amongst the camp. Um, then you'll 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 do well. And you were at Team Bath with Matt Taylor as well a few years ago. Someone you know quite well. Tell us about your relationship with him. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, well, I played. I didn't actually get to play with Matt, um, but he he was he was at Team Bath and then and then left the year I I came. Um, so I kind of kind of had to re replace him. So sort of big shoes to fill, really. He obviously went went to join Exeter and, and play, um, and then I was just starting out at, at Team Bath. Then, um, well, what is it about the club that made you want to want to come to the club? Lots of things, really. Lots of watching last year, watching how how well the, the team the team set up, the, how close the team were to, to getting promotion. Um, the gaffer himself, um, he, he's a winner, and he's he's someone that. This, this dedicated to his job and very professional, um, and it's something for me that that, that obviously rubs off um, on me and on on the other players. Um, so obviously for, for him for last year he had a had a, had a great season last year. Um, and I, I just want to come and be part of that this year and hopefully get the lads over the line and take them take them if we can to the, the next step. And you've been in Jersey for a couple of days now with the team. What are they like as a bunch? Brilliant, brilliant, really good group of lads. Um, in terms of team spirit, it's this this is what I think will set. Set us apart from from a lot of other other teams. I've been a, ran a few few different clubs before in the past. Um, obviously, I've only been here for for a couple of days, um, so I'm still still settling in. But but in terms of the, the welcome, they've been they've been brilliant to me so far. How important do you think trips like this are for in terms of team bonding for the new season? Yeah, excellent. I think this is this is what you need. Um, it, it, it means the lads can kind of sort of let the hair down a little bit um, and, and probably spend a bit more downtime together as a team. Rather than when you're during the season, sometimes other lads have got other other agendas, families, and things like that, so you don't see as much of each other. But but, but weeks like this, um, I think, are, are brilliant for for team bonding and, and morale building. And for those that haven't seen much of you, what sort of defender can we expect to see? Um, I like like to think I'm I'm, I'm consistent, um, strong, uh, very aggressive. Um, and I like to think that, that like I said, I help motivate and, and encourage lads um, to, to be the best they can be and to, to drive the standards and, and keep them as high as they can be.